to see you here today. I, one of my favourite things at bookshops. Um, they're very tough, though. Um, they're very tough, as I was saying earlier. Um, <coughs> you want to have a place where you, you feel comfortable to go, and I must say with these cakes and coffee, it's quite comfortable coming here, uh, and where you are surprised by at least one book and think, that I would like to read. And I think that's what makes it a real <coughs> art to run a bookshop. It's of course tougher now because we can all download them. But I'm thinking of the ones that I that, that always draw me in and that I always leave with books that I didn't expect to buy. I'm thinking of Daunt's bookshop in Notting Hill, of John Sandow's just behind Peter Jones off King of the King's Road in London, fantastic bookshop. Um, this which I had uh, hadn't seen or heard a lot about, but hadn't seen, hadn't been in till today. I rarely come to Skull, it's an awful long way from Kilco. <laughs> um, and of course, the Time Travellers Bookshop in Skibbereen, which uh, second hand books, but nevertheless a bookshop that you go into. Well, I've spent afternoons there um, just being surprised. And I think that's the art to, to, to present books, to be able to know your public. And I think it's really hard, and it's too easy to, to get them online. But without, I, I've certainly never got, gone through, um, flipped through my computer and said, oh, there's a book I'd love. Mm -hmm. So you are not, you know, online is a great place to buy books that you know you want. But the great thing about bookshops, and the joy, I think, of coming to bookshops, um, is to be introduced to books you didn't think you knew or didn't think you wanted, or, or, uh, uh, and to go out with with having had a bit of an adventure with a, with a new journey in your hand. Um, I personally love that feeling of the book. I'm not someone who, I think I've been given two Kindles and I pass them both on. Um, for me, books are, they, they suck up your soul. And when you finish reading them, there's part of you in them. And I like to put them in a bookshelf and maybe pass them on to someone else and they give it me back. Because it's sort of part of you, I think, a good book. Um, Kindle, well I've never read a book on Kindle, I tried, I read a page or two and I thought, I really don't get this at all. And, and f for me, the, the smell of the book, the feel of the book, the, the fact I can tell that in chapter four I had a bath and, <laughs> and, and, and read that bit when I was in the bath, because it's all gone crinkly. Um, uh, uh, and, uh, uh, and then it remains with you. Favourite books, I don't know, I, I would say to you if you if you are interested at all in philosophy and history, in a very light way, read Night Train to Lisbon, which we've just filmed, and the film isn't half as good as the book. Mm -hmm. um, uh, uh, Sandor Marai, I, I've been working in Hungary, and so I've come across Sandor Marai, for, of which there are some wonderful translations. Embers, fantastic book. Um, Journey by Moonlight. Uh, could sort of go on, except I, because I'm a, a, of an age where once a book is too away, I've forgotten the title of it. <laughs> um, but I, I, I'm surrounded by books. I also have a, a, I have a wife who is a voracious reader, and we're forever saying we've got to go through the bookshelves, because they're all now double stacked and stacked on top of each <laughs> other. Um, we have too many, uh, and to keep the ones that are really close to the heart. So anyway, thank you for coming. Um, I think I've said all I wanted to say. Well, I've probably said too much. Um, I, I, you know, let's try and encourage this because bookshops do make the quality of life better. And everywhere I look, and maybe this is age, I don't know, everywhere I look I think the quality of life is slipping in many, many areas, um, often commercial areas. And I think a good bookshop, uh, and you're lucky enough to have one here in Skull, a good bookshop is something that, especially if it serves coffee and, and um, what are they call cupcakes, cupcakes uh, <laughs> it is, is sort of manna from heaven for a village. So you're very lucky and you must support this and let's put the message out that let's try and support every bookshop we can that's struggling on and allow it to go from perhaps strength to strength even. Thank you. Thank you very much for coming and that's all I have to say, isn't it? Yes,